hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in ASP.NET using AngularJS how to show and hide the password and here we got a new update notice we got the I symbol which is closed which means the password is unhide if I click the I symbol showing the password hide the password show the password if you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am creating a new ASP.NET application. Go to File, New, Project. And from the web templates, I am selecting ASP.NET Web Application and the .NET Framework I am using 4.6.1. The application name is AngularJS Show Hide password is a project name click ok and from the templates I'm selecting empty click ok and the project is created successfully let's open solution explorer now in this project I notice the scripts folder when I expand that one we got two JS files now let's install the AngularJS application files to this project. Right click the project name. Manage Nudget Packages. Click that one. Select the browse and search for AngularJS. And from the search results, I'm selecting the AngularJS, the first option. Click install. click OK let's open solution explorer and notice the AngularJS files are installing and also notice there is a green tick mark which means the AngularJS is installed successfully in our project let's minimize the scripts folder as well as I'm closing this nudget package window now let's add a new web form page right click the project name add web form the item name I'm changing to show hide password AngularJS is a web page name click OK and here we got the source page now in the header section after the title I'm adding the AngularJS script Open Solution Explorer, expand the scripts folder, in the test bundles come to the bottom, there is the angular.js file, just drag and drop on the web form page. After that, now between the form and due tag, I am adding the center tag. I am adding the header section h1. Show hide password using AngularJS ASP.NET tutorials. After header tag, I'm adding the horizontal line. After that, after horizontal line, I'm adding enter password. Let's add a text box control, open toolbox. In the standard folder, come to the bottom, there is a toolbox control. Just double click that button. And now in this text box control, I'm adding the property text mode is equals to password mode. Now after that, I am adding the do container the id is equals to show hide div and this do container is the toggle button control to show and hide the password of the text box control that's it we have added the designing part now in the script section I am adding another script to write the AngularJS functionality 
creating a variable app is equals to angular dot module function the module method takes two parameters in this module method I'm adding two parameters the first one is a angular application name between single quotes I'm adding my app comma and the array semicolon now next we'll add a controller app dot controller the controller is a method the name first parameter is a name which is a controller name I'm adding between single quotes I'm adding my controller name comma the callback definition is a function function dollar scope semicolon now the first condition is dollar scope dot show password is equals to an adding false after that I'm adding another functionality for the toggle button for this do container dollar scope dot dot toggle show password is equal I'm adding a function now in this toggle function if the password is visible dollar scope dot show password I want to hide the password scope dot password semicolon and that's it we have written the angular js script and now after the horizontal line I am adding another div tag copy this one and paste so this div tag I am adding ng app is equal to between double quotes ng app is a angular js director which takes a angular application name which is my app and the next director I am adding ng iphone controller Let's add the controller name is my controller. And now here, what are the controls we are adding between this do tag? It belongs to this Angular application. So after that, the password I'm adding the Angular expression. ng I find attribute type is equals to. Here I'm adding the Angular expression between curly braces I'm adding this show password question mark between single quotes the property I'm adding text colon and that's it we have added the angular direct to ng attribute type in the text box control now let's add here show hide I'm adding ng iPhone click is equals to now in this directory I'm adding this function name toggle show password that's it let's check the output Google Chrome and here we got the output now let's enter the password and I type some text here I have entered some text which is in the text password mode when I click show hide password it's showing the password when I click again this label show hide div toggle button it's hiding the password now my aim is instead of show hide the label I want to add some glyph icons with a symbol i symbol so for that I'm adding open a new browser I'm typing bootstrap cdn font awesome let's search for that cdn link and from the search results the first option font awesome let's click that one i 
and boot subsidian is a free open source so we don't require any license for this just copy this font awesome CSS click to copy copy this one and add stop debugging in the header section after the angular script a link href is equal to I'm pasting the CDN link is equal to style sheet so after that I'm adding the glyph icons to this div container which is a toggle button ng iPhone I'm adding the class attribute between double quotes I'm adding the expression between curly braces single quotes the class I'm adding the gif icon class to show the password fa fa for i colon and this show password copy this one and paste here comma now the next gif icon I'm adding to close the eye which is uh, hiding the password fa fa f1 i iphone slash colon hide the password which is not show password and I don't require this label show hide that's it we have added the clip icons to this due toggle button using this bootstrap cdn font awesome cdn link that's it we have done the complete coding part let's check the final results I'm reloading the browser link and here we got a new update notice we got the i symbol which is closed which means the password is in hide if I click the i symbol showing the password hide the password show the password and that's it we have implemented to show and hide the password using angular.js in ASP.NET